everybody hello welcome back to my channel this is marcos from m3 reviews just checking it out again how you guys doing we're in october 19th i believe something like that yeah it's october 19th saturday uh midday had a couple beers already what are you guys doing hey man um uh, i've been busy just like i always say busy busy you know fucking shit doing and uh, just wanted to uh, check you guys out and uh, you know, uh, you guys already saw what the thumbnail was, what I brought you in here for, but uh, hey, uh, just real quick, over the last week or two, uh, last week since I did la my last video, two weeks or whatever, and uh, just wanna show you guys some of the things I got. I picked up the Siege Thundercracker and Impactor, that Blue Lobster, X-Frank, it's just a statue figure it doesn't pose or nothing so if you guys are thinking about get that think twice if you just want something that sits there check that out right there he just stands there right Frankenstein kind of thing I got the siege Mirage I got six shot from mastermind creations from big bad toy store he was like 40% off so I was like fuck yeah I'm gonna get that thing he's pretty sick I pulled him out of the box love him I got siege barricade and I got this chick just because she looks cool and uh, yeah, I love that robot girls you know what I mean and I did pre-order the Big Fire Bird Nice C. I don't even care if she's a good quality figure. I just like that look. I mean, check these out. Mm? Fucking badass. I love that. Anyway, check this out. Mm, fantastic. As always, I'm going to keep doing it, you guys. I love it. I'm going to give some shout outs to some new subscribers. You know, you guys, thank you very much for checking me out. I love it, man. Thanks a lot. Got your Sue Schmidt Bizwas. And Gamor just wanted to give you a shout out again because you were like, what the fuck? Yeah, it's cool, man. Hope you had a good time with your girls, bro. Your Dragon Hunter, Why Not Collect, Greg Vasquez, Danny Lee, Anthony Most Politis, Cameron Price, Ken G, and TF Fan Page 101. Thanks for subscribing, man. I appreciate that. You got a good channel. I was checking you out. You got a lot of fucking videos. Good for you. That's great. You're funny. Hella good, man. Thanks a lot, man. If you guys haven't checked him out, check him out. TF Fan Page 101. David Lynchon, I know you're already subscribed, bro. I just wanted to mention you, and I hope you had fun in Disneyland. <clears throat> Let the sarcasm roll through the room real quick. I, I love that place, but I hate that place. You know what I'm saying? I hope you had a good time, bro. Shadowless Soul, what's up? I love dark shit. Like that name, man. William White. TM Gaming 77U45, what's up? John Corcoran. Your hand Solo 10. Google Tristan, the Fox and Gamer. You drew Badbury. Red Grinder Rider. Thanks a lot, you guys. I appreciate that. And Ewald Merz, man, I know I keep mentioning you, bro, but I did see NL Soundwave um, a long time ago in a couple of my other videos. He um, posted a comment or whatever. What's up, NL? How you doing, bro? And uh, you sent me the link for his uh, collection video. Fucking awesome. I appreciate that. I, I love looking at collection videos and uh, NL Soundwave. Bro, you got a sick collection too, man. Uh, very, very nice. Uh, looks really good. Very clean. I love Detoffs. I love the way you set them all up, man. It looks really good. If, if any of you guys are interested in checking out a collection, check out NL Soundwave. Um, very, very cool. Very nice collection. Good job, man. Appreciate that. And uh, don't look at my arms, Ewald and NL. I know you guys go to the gym, but I haven't been going, man. I'm lagging. But uh, excellent, you guys. Thanks for a lot. Thanks for commenting. Oh, excuse me. And another shout out to my boy, Big Stan Harris. Yo, hey, check out what Big Stan Harris sent me in the mail. Now, uh, he didn't have to do that. He just was like, hey, check it out. I got this at Target. And I, and I, and I texted him back, yo, that's hella cool, man. Fucking badass. And he's like, hey, I'm sending, you, I'm sending one your way. And I was like, no, nah, don't do that, man. It's cool. He goes, no, nah, it's already packaged. going to you. And I was like, man, dude, that's fucking sick, man. Hey, I appreciate that, Big Stan. And uh, my Siege collection is just growing and growing and growing. I love it. Very cool. Um, Big Stan, happy late birthday to you, bro. And th everybody out there, check out Big Stan Harris um, in his collection uh, videos as well. I know I've mentioned him before. But uh, this this dude right here, now he also uh, does like uh, almost semi-pro wrestling right there. Right, Check out this guy's belt he just got. Good for you, Big Stan. I, I appreciate all you do, man. I love all your texts, man. It's great talking to somebody, uh, you know, that does this kind of stuff too. All you guys, man. Very cool. And obsessed. You are a funny man, sir. <laughs> I, I love when you comment and, uh, and uh, you know, send me messages and shit. Dude, you're hella funny. And that one where you're like, uh, is it hella weird that I'm uh, sitting here watching your videos with no pants on? <laughs> Dude, I fucking laughed at that, man. That's hella funny, bro. Hella funny. But no, it's not weird at all, man. 
Fuck it, you know? My pants are off right now. <laughs> mm. But yeah, I still have not gotten my dragon yet, and you won the race. Good for you, and uh, I'm still trying. I, every day I fucking look at my, um, my shipping, and it hasn't even left China yet, so I'm like, damn. Anyways, so in my other video that I did this guy here, you guys, I just wanted to bring in, uh, I just wanted to bring you guys in here for uh, the uh, Fans Toys Maverick, the uh, G1 Silver Bolt. So as you guys know, this is what he looks like right here. Now, I, I haven't opened him out of the box yet. I got him two weeks ago, and uh, I fucking love him. I, I do look at the box, and every day I'm like, open him up, open him up. I'm like, nah, I want to do a video and an unboxing, you know what I mean? I, I like doing that. It's fun to do, and uh, some of you guys that haven't watched other Silver Bolt videos yet, um, maybe this one will you know, spark your interest in getting this guy. This, this is Fans Toys Superion. Um, this guy's big. That Superion robot is going to look fantastic. Um, I'm going to fucking set up the white backdrop and open the box up and check him out with you guys. See you in a second. <clears throat> All right, you guys, so here he is. Now, I don't know about you guys, but whenever I get these things, I can't wait to open them up. And it's been about two weeks, so I'm gonna get this guy opened up. But first, check out this box right here. It is, they, you know, Fans Toys, I'll say it a hundred times, they're great. Uh, they're fucking just fantastic. Look at that, just really good detail. This is the Concorde, came out, I don't know when it came out, but it, it's fucking badass. I remember it was a fast-ass jet. Um, very cool that Fans Toys um, put it out. Cut that open right there. Let's get this thing opened up. Man, hey, if you guys could see my face right now, I'm smiling. Like, I, I love these things. I think they're just, I'm glad that uh, toys are available these days for us to, you know, purchase and get and have in our collections, all that kind of stuff. So first thing, right off the get-go, you get the uh, um, instruction booklet, of course, and you get your card. And the card, I know, is a hard plastic. Let's get this opened up. Hmm, very nice book. That's the book right there. We'll get that. Let's see what it looks like on uh, any page. Oh, man. Very good detail. Very good color. Look at that. Very nice. Let's get a smell in here. Oh, it smells like a, like a new magazine. Very cool. Look at that. That's beautiful. Very nice. All right, set that aside. And you get your card. And I do collect cards, you guys. I know I've said it before. I'll say it again. There's nothing wrong with cards. All right, set that aside. You get this guy open. All right, so I'm just going to cut the four tapes here. Cool. All right, get this top off. Man, look at that right out of the package. Uh, sick. He's big, you guys. He's fucking big. Cool. Set that off to the side. Oh, sweet. Look at how can you go wrong? Fans toys, thank you very much, you guys. Awesome. All right, pull this guy out. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, it smells like foam. <laughs> Styrofoam. Anyway, super cool. You guys have this guy yet? Um, I, uh, I'm going to stand him up. Now, that's how he comes right out of the box, and I've already watched a couple reviews that say you have to mess with the shoulders, you have to mess with something else in order to get him uh, legit. But let's check out his accessories right out of the box real quick. So you get his um, blaster, right? Um, good. It's like a little wing jet right there itself. Cool. That's not bad. No paint, just black. Excellent. Set that off. And you get his head right here. Check that out. Not bad. Got a little screen face to him. Cool. Side. I won't be using this head. I like the head that's on him now. Screw ports in the back. Squared up on top. Mushroom peg acceptance on the bottom. That right there. All right, and you get his alternate face scope. Let me get this open. Cool, I think I like that one. I might put that one in there. That looks pretty good. All right, I'll set him off to the side right there. Get rid of the styrofoam, nothing on the back. Cool. All right, here he is right here. I'm gonna get him set up. Give me a second. All right, you guys, so what I do is I took the camera off real quick, and I want to get in close. I got the flash on. I'm going to go right to his face real quick. Look at this guy. That is beautiful. Good job. Look at that. Okay, so, what, you know, just from pulling him out, he was a little loose in some areas, but I think that I could tighten up some screws 
and make it good. And he's not bad at all. I just noticed that he's a little bit more loose than some of the other fans' toys figures. So, well, who cares? You know, whatever. It's just a toy. So you got to just, you know, manipulate some certain things and make some certain things tight. So that's great. But uh, just looking at him, I was playing with him for a second. I did not transform him yet, but I do like all the gold. This is gold, you guys. It comes off in the camera. It's a little bit yellow, but it's gold. And you got some silver right here. Um, that's fantastic. And all these little details in here on his arm real quick. Got your crotch right there and his abdomen. Man, he is a good piece, and he's big. He's tall. I, I like these big figures, and I think Superion's going to look great. Look at this other side right here. He's got all the jet parts on him. That's great. Come down on his thighs. Again, that is gold, not yellow. Uh, there is a metallic flake in there, too, and I think that metallic looks really good. I wish the camera picked it up just a little bit better. Um, you got your clear accents here. Very nice right there, and he's a solid figure. Um, when you turn him upside down on his... Um, on the bottom side of his feet right here, you, there is a little bit of hollowness that goes up in his legs, but that's okay. And look at right here, look at all that metallic in there. I don't know if you guys can see that. Oh, that's beautiful. Uh, they did really good. It's almost like, uh, I, I don't know, but this pearlescent is way better than the um, Fans Toys Jetfire when they came out with their second run on that for the limited edition. This is um, better paint than that. You can pick up a lot of the metallic a lot better. So that's super cool. All right, let me get him on his backside. Give me a second. Let me check him out. Look at that guy. Fantastic. Give me a second. This is what he looks like from the backside. Um, not bad at all. This is a whole entire Concorde jet folded up into his backpack. Got all this stuff is just really good. Let me get up top real quick right here on the top side. All this red is metallic red. You got some die cast, obviously, right? And uh, I think you guys have probably seen some other reviews on this guy. He is just folded up, and that's how they do it. You got to. And uh, I have no problem with that. All this backpack, they did so good on the engineering. I think it's great. Look, at got some, are those wheels right here? Yeah, it's got these wheels right there. That's cool. Coming down around the back, that, uh, just great. Good job, fans, toys, loving it, perfect. Oh man, I'm glad to have this guy in my figure. I can't wait for the other guys to come out. Goose is still on pre-order and get him from the side over here on his foot. Excellent, coming up, look at that, look at that paint. I love it. So this guy is another good figure, uh, absolutely. Look at that. All right, you guys, now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get him transformed. I am gonna watch MGO 316 because that guy is really good. I might even watch Ben's Collectibles, check him out just to see how they do it. See you in a second. Perfect. Sorry, you guys. Before I transform him, let me do some size comparisons real quick. Check this out. So this is that Frank that I got, and uh, check him out. Now, this is, uh, I've never watched the cartoon with this guy, but this is the size comparison with this guy right here. Um, cool. Let me drop the camera down real quick and get a different angle here. Cool. All right. So, like I said, this guy's okay if you just like uh, non-posable, non-transforming, just stand there statues. Let me get him out of the way. Not bad. All right. And let me get in Jazz. I love this Jazz, you guys. He is absolutely amazing. That guy looks good, but look at that guy. Now, this is a, a good bot. He's very, he's very good in size, you know what I mean? And so look how much this guy just towers over him. That's great. Love Jazz. Perfect. Get him out of the way. And then here is Terminus Hexatron or Six Shot from Mastermind Creations, like this guy. Now he's a good, uh, he's he's a couple heads shorter, um, not bad, but uh, I like this guy a lot too. He he's a, a good figure, pretty cool. Uh, the back of him, of course, is taller, but look at his head size from here. His head size up here. Turn his noggin this way. Very cool, like that. Get him out of the way. All right, and here is your Cyclonus. He's a good bot. Fans Toys did really good with him. I like that guy a lot. Check him out. He's another good jet. Maybe I'll transform him in jet mode and get the two size comparisons with that as well. Very cool. All right. Get him out of the way. I like Cyclonus. Look at that. Beautiful. All right. Set him off. And you got your G1 Jetfire right here. Everybody likes Skyfire, but I said Jetfire. I don't care. That's Jetfire. So he's a good figure. Um, definitely this guy just towers over him as well. And uh, he's tall, so that's cool. Get him out of the way. 
Oh, and what's that you say? You want to see some titties? All right, check it out. Look at this girl right here. This is prison school. <laughs> I, ooh, look at that. The boobs are sparkling. But let me now. This is a good uh, eight-inch figure when she stands up. I think she's like ten-inch. But look at her right there next to him. Fucking sick. Now she is just all about the tatas. You know what I'm saying? Just fucking awesome. I love her. She's great. Check her out. Let me get her rotated off to the side so you get a little back port of that right there. Check that out. Nothing wrong with that right there. Cool. All right. So let me get these sizes out of the way and get these things offset to the side and I'll get this guy transformed. Give me a second. All right, you guys, real quick, I am jumping around here and I apologize for that. You know what I'm doing is I'm drinking and my friend came over, so my, my mind got kind of scrambled real quick. But I do want to do articulation. I want to show you something. All right, now this guy's good. This is how floppy he is. In your opinion, you tell me, is he too floppy? Okay, so I don't think so. Uh, after checking him out, but this right here is really kind of not too, but I know it's not too bad. But I know I could tighten these screws up, which would tighten up right in here, right? You know what I mean? And that's bad. And it's not bad at all. Um, I think his feet are really fucking heavy. So that's cool. But and then everything else to flop, he's not that bad at all. And then the backside right here, uh, I moved that real quick. Let me put that back. But no, he's great. And so if I ever, if I meant to come across like he was too floppy, he is absolutely not. He's really good. Um, getting him stood up is, is fine. His uh, arms are fine. His head is fine. This guy is great, and I, I absolutely like him a lot. Um, so let's go through just so, some stuff that you guys already know. Now, his head uh, can turn. I think it could do a 360, but it goes up that far, down, you know, and that's great. Uh, his arms do go. Look at that. The arm, the arm due to the transformation, the, those joints right there. I mean, he can get all the way out plus and then put him back up, put it back up. That's great. There's nothing wrong with that. And then you got his um, full rotation. Everybody likes to see that, I guess. You know what I mean? And then his bicep swivel. Um, that's really good. What is he hung up on real quick right here? Let's go all the way around. Cool. And then his elbow. His elbow does not do a 90 because it does stop right here. So that's another thing that's fine. You know, um, it's, there's nothing wrong with that. Cool. And then all of his little hands and fingers, they do um, come out. You guys, you guys know that. Display. They do not move apart. They're not... That, get that checked out right there cool um, just a hand a fans toys hand nothing wrong with that they are really tight the thumb is kind of loose but not bad and let's see his waist right here good a uh, little bit of mount but of course it hits the rear and you got your hip skirts right here that kind of thing everything kind of flips up and out of the way good and you got your up range motion so okay so look at that Did you see that watch Okay, so that falls down a little bit, but again, not too bad because I'm not fucking playing with these things. I'm just taking them out, transforming them a couple times, and they go right up in my display. Um, and I think a lot of us are like that. I don't think a lot of us sit here and play with these things. You don't put them in the dirt, and I've said that before. Nobody takes these things out, you know, and, and, and messes with them. They just like to see the actual bot, and I think that's that's important to, to get, you know. As a lot of people are like, oh, it doesn't do this, and it doesn't do that, and he's really... The, it doesn't fucking matter unless you're a kid and you actually play with these things. There's the bottom of the, the, the leg, the feet that I was talking about it was real hollow. I could stick my finger in there, kind of combiner wars kind of thing. Oh, look, I think I did fuck that up. Look at that. That covers that up right there. And you get a heel spur. Excuse me. Let me pull this out. Lay him down real quick. There we go. Okay, so my bad. Look at that. There's the difference right there. Okay. So you can see that this whole thing folds out from the foot right here and that gives him a bigger, uh, uh, more stable stance. So that's cool. Let me get this one out too. There we go. And not hard to do. That's good. So now he can pretty much stand on his feet. Good. All right. So I like that. And uh, other, everything else is just, you know, you get this, um, you get your knees, you get your ankles, that kind of thing. So that's cool. I do like that. That's not bad at all. Um, this guy's amazing. I. I do like when a toy's semi-loose, you know, because if he's, if he's too tight, then you're like, oh shit, am I going to break that? You never know. So this guy is like right on the cusp of being loose and right on the cusp of that's where you want it, excuse me, that's where I want him to be, you know. I don't need him to be super fucking tight. I don't want him to be super tight. I think, um, you know, although I like other things to be tight, but uh, <laughs> yeah, 
you know what I mean? But uh, it's cool. I love it. All right, so now I'm going to go ahead and get him transformed into his jet mode. I'm going to go watch MGO 316's review on him real quick, the JTI, and then uh, check you guys out in a second. All right, you guys. So, man, I watched MGO 316, and that guy is awesome. I mean, his JTI for this guy is fucking perfect. I was able to get through him and uh, had no problems whatsoever. Uh, everything tabbed in perfectly. Of course, there's a little bits here's and there's, but check this guy out. Let me take the camera off. Um, I absolutely just think uh, JTI is just great. Excuse me, MGO 316, but um, look at this. Coming in at the front. Now, all this stuff on mine pegged in so well. It is not bad at all. And uh, look at the landing gears, chrome. The wheels move, all the windows are painted. Um, it's just fantastic. Another good job from Fans Toys. Look at how level everything is. And look at now, he's, a, he's panel y, of course, now, but look, everything is perfect. If you get yours and it doesn't snap in together because it did, did not with mine, oh man, you guys just keep working with it, work with it, and watch it. And there's little, little tabs and shit that gotta be flipped the right way. Here's the underside. See the red part where his shoulders are? Look, look, look at that metallic. Uh, see the red part? Now, it's not level to the plane, but that's how JTI did it as well. And it just fucking is like that, okay? So here's the backside over here. Beautiful. And I'm going to go ahead and pick him up. Now, he's huge, you guys. He, he is a long jet. Watch, watch when I pick him up real quick from here and get the bottom side. Look at there, there is not a bot that you could see. They hit them really well. And that's that's my whole thing with jets. It, does it look like a fucking robot that just got turned upside down? And You know what I mean? And he's great. Look at that. Perfect. Okay, and then coming in, I'm going to set him back down. Cool. He's not, I'm acting like he's delicate, but he's not. He's pretty fucking solid. Okay, and he's not floppy. You know what I mean? Okay, so coming up right here. This is his top side. Loving it metallics i keep saying that but it's like pearl you know what i mean look at that big old chunk of die cast uh everything pour, pour, just pulled together great you guys uh, let me put this right here okay so there's a piece that there we go okay cool nice oh it's beautiful you guys check them out if you guys like like this look at that oh it's sick all right, so I'm gonna uh, set him down and get him into some size comparisons. You guys, I had really, really no problems transforming him. I'm not even sweating. It took me about 20 minutes, but I mean, for the first time, look at the underside. Oh, that's great. <laughs> Another one, perfect. I'm gonna leave him in his fucking bot on his uh, jet mode until I get all of them together. So he's gonna look really good in the cabinet. All right, let me get him in with some size comparisons. Give me a second. All right, first you guys, let's go with Generation 1 Jetfire. Here's this little guy right here. Man, I, who's transformed Jetfire in a while? Because I'm telling you what, you guys, it got me for a second. I was like, how in the fuck you transform this again? And boom, got him. Perfect, that's good. Good, good, love it. Okay, get him out of here. And here is Fans Toys Cyclonus. Oh, man. Now, who's fucking transformed that in a while? Dude, that guy is no joke. And uh, I did not watch a video. I just went through it from my memory. And it's been about a year since I transformed him last. But look at that guy. That's great. These things look amazing. I love that Cyclonus. Uh, and, you know, uh, size comparison wise, um, Silver Bolt is about three inches longer. Um, and he's great. Uh, I think they look really good. Cyclonus, if you guys don't have him, get this guy right here. He looks badass. All right, move him off to the side. And here is Rensora Megatron from the movie Transformers 5. Here he comes right here. And I did this because he's just a big jet, right? Look at that guy right there. Got a good wingspan. Um, that's pretty cool. Now this guy's been in his jet mode since I took him out of the box, but he's pretty cool. Now those are about um, same as, this guy's uh, about the same as Cyclonus. Awesome, uh, great Transformers, I love it. All right, let me get this guy out of here. All right, you guys, there he is. That is Fans Toys FT30A Silver Bolt Maverick. Now, uh, if you guys don't have this, I highly suggest getting him. I was kind of worried about all of the um, panels and was it going to lock in and all this kind of stuff after watching reviews, but he's great. He feels really good. He feels really solid. 
I don't have a problem with him at all. I love him, he's great. He's gonna go right into the cabinet in this mode right here. Excellent. I'll talk to you guys later. Deuces.